Hey guys, Crew of Blonde Wave, I'm Eric. And I'm Calvin. Calvin, we're gonna do something a little different today. A little bit different. You have not seen Game of Thrones. Any of it. One of the best television shows and best fantasy novels I've yeah. ever read or seen. Or experienced or loved, because I do love this. I, I love I've heard you and Aaron talk. You yeah. love it very much. It's all over the place. Everybody talks about it. I don't know how you haven't seen it. I've tried to keep myself away from it as much as possible. Yeah so that I'm not ruined, mm -hmm. and that when I jump into it, I'm fully immersed. Well, just like Dragon Ball Z, we're going to show you watching something that a lot of people love for the first time. Yeah. So you guys need to strap in, because we got Seven. five seasons of five Game seasons. of Thrones to go through. That's like 50 episodes, it's right? It's 10 episodes a season. Sheesh, that's, yep. but, uh, that's as many as Dragon Ball Z. Uh, so Calvin has not seen it or read it. Mm -hmm. I've seen it, I've read it, so I'm going to be your... Captain on this voyage, uh, <laughs> my tour guide. I'm like walking Game of Thrones encyclopedia. Right. So we're gonna delve deep into the lore. You know, I, I know you're a huge Tolkien fan. Oh yeah. So you, I know Absolutely. you're gonna love this. I'm very interested to see how how we watch this thing. Yeah. All right. So make sure you guys strap in. Uh, make sure you tell all of your friends that like Game of Thrones. Uh, it's gonna be really fun to watch. So here we go. This is episode one. Winter is coming. I've heard. I've seen that on so many games. <laughs> let's let's see what it's about. Okay. place to have like a base mm -hmm. you know what do you think it is ah uh, some kind this is of great you know prison you know no. nothing i love I, it i love I, it so much i don't know <laughs> anything i mean it could be like a, a giant wall that is just been hewn away for many hundreds of years very big wall it is they went separate directions are they hunting See, I love it because I, I know all the answers and I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> I know. They're super fast. Wow. Big guy. What's this thing? Seems like a, a wall. A wall. A wall 700 feet high and a thousand miles long. I wonder what they have that for. Probably to keep the, the Scots out. <laughs> the what? The Scots out. The Scots out? <laughs> From the North ones. <laughs> oh, who's that guy? That's badass. <laughs> Look at that. Yep. So 
than one, Calvin. What do you think? <laughs> kind of gross, huh? <laughs> the people that I like haven't proved that they're they're worthy of being liked. Well, what do you mean? Well, like, I like I like the Starks. So far, I'm not disliking the personality of the king. Robert Baratheon. Baratheon. Yeah. All the others that you're not supposed to like, mm -hmm. I definitely don't you like. You definitely don't like. See, that's the beauty of Game <laughs> of Thrones because you will be challenged in your initial impressions, I think. I Yes, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. And then we just had straight up twin cest. Right. Twin cest and then child immediate murder. child murder. Yep. So straight into that. No yeah. no breather. Mm -hmm. No like, oh that just happened. Yep. And then and that's the end. Yeah. Calvin, you remember everything that's happened on Game of Thrones? There's a lot. <laughs> there is a lot. There's no uh, pre-show recap, is there? Uh, I don't remember if there is one season one. Eventually they start doing it. Okay. But, I mean, um, I, I remember pretty much everything. Yeah. You know, it was all just terribleness. It was... It was, it was I love terrible. that. I love that you think this is terribleness. <laughs> this is like the good times. <laughs> the good times. This is the good old days. The golden years. <laughs> <laughs> That's Prince Joffrey. You'll learn to really love him. Yeah. Yep. I don't believe you. That's Joffrey's younger siblings. So Cersei's children with King Robert. But even if a boy lives, he'd be a cripple. Is my mother alive? Does she know about me, where I am, where I'm going? Does she care? The next time we see each other, We'll talk about your mother. Mm -hmm. I promise. He will not cross. If by chance he does, we'll throw him back into the sea. I love when they get tense. They're so good. There's a war coming then. No! Oh, grab it! Ugh. Better her hands than her neck. Yeah, donkey! All the dogs were howling before danger happened, right? Yeah. He's so dead. <laughs> that puppy wrecked his shit. <laughs> yeah. That's a, that is a puppy. Yeah. <laughs> so someone sent somebody to kill Bran. I can only assume who. Yeah. He's keeping those eggs warm. Just in a little shrine. They're fossils, Calvin. Everyone knows dragons are born of fire. Dude, what the hell is this shit? <laughs> I guess if you're Danny, you're pretty lucky if you got sold off to a barbarian if it's Jason Momoa. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> yeah, I could probably learn to live with this, I guess. Yeah. No. No. It's the Arya, leave him alone! Yeah. Just throw a sword in the water. <laughs> Hey. Told you you'd like him. <laughs> I told you I didn't believe you. Yeah, he gets better from here. <sighs> Maybe. Run. Oh, Maria. Go, please, now. Hmm. Oh, thank Calvin. 
It's always hard to see dogs be killed. I mean, you, don't, you don't even really see it because it's so no. hard to watch. But I hate people with too much power. And that don't deserve it. Well, you might be watching the wrong show. <laughs> <laughs> I like intrigue. Yeah. I like characters interacting with each other. Of course, yeah. But I hate people who are written into a show that are designed to be hated. <laughs> people who are just slimy because... Like Joffrey, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. Well, maybe there's a reason he's like that. Maybe we'll find out soon. I think I know why. Well, why? <sighs> Don't want to say it. I mean, have you heard something? No. Well, what's what are you talking about? What's what, what's a thing that you can... What's a theory? Just wondering how long that twin cest has been going on. Yeah, we have some evidence, don't we? Yeah. Okay. A lot of the king's children are blonde when we all know that blonde is a recessive trait. What did Cersei say when she was talking to Catelyn? She said she had a boy and he With was a black-haired beauty yeah. and he died. Now all of her other children are very fair. Mm -hmm. Robert doesn't seem like the kind of guy who's going to have recessive genes. Not at all. <laughs> You might be onto something, I don't know. See, this is what's fun about watching this show with a smart guy. He picks this kind of stuff up. I love Robert Baratheon, and I love the way Mark Addy plays him. Just, just quiet, woman! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know? I love when he said seven hells. Yeah. Seven hells, Ned. <laughs> it's really good music. Uh, it is, isn't it? Yeah, I love it. You really get into it. There's a video of these, uh, these like, opera singers... Like these, like Polynesian opera singers doing this. Oh and yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> is that, they're like is that all acapella. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's amazing. Yeah, it's awesome. Oh, we'll you have to watch that, that yeah. sometime as like a bonus or something yeah. like that. All right, let's get into it. Based on the novels of George R. R. Martin, like J. R. R. Tolkien. I know. <laughs> funny how that. Uh, yeah, funny how that worked out. I love Ravens. <laughs> they just look so happy all the time. <laughs> it's true, isn't it? What makes the Lord tell about my legs? It's paralyzed? Just his lower half. He's a paraplegic. It's terrible. You and I, he could have lingered on the edge of the battle with the smart boys, and today his wife would be making him miserable. His sons would be ingrates. And he'd be waking three times in the night to piss into a bowl of wine. <laughs> Love Robert. <laughs> what is it you? When you saw it for the first time. <laughs> I wanted to be here when you saw that for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> Man, she's so damn good looking. Isn't she? Yeah. Shit! Shit! Oh, that. <laughs> Seems like every time we see that box, there are more candles around it. Yeah. The dragon is the sigil of House Targaryen, you know. She sees it to be symbolic that she has those eggs. Hmm. Lucky son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you could not say anything. <laughs> He's pissing off the side of the world. Hey, that's what he wanted. Yeah. He's a man of his word. 700 seats. I love Sarah. Tomorrow you won't catch him. <laughs> <laughs> Eric, come in here and sing with us. Meow. 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 Get out of here. Oh. Drogo's marching the wrong way with my army. He doesn't grasp it, does he? I don't think he does. He's remarkably stupid. He's very entitled. I've seen a man from Ashai with a dagger of real dragon glass. Mm. I've seen a man who could change his face the way that other men change their clothes. And I've seen a pirate. There he is. Strong for his age. He works hard. Look at me. Get back to work, lad. 
If the day ever comes when that boy would rather wield a sword than forge one, you send him to me. Find anything? King Robert's bastard son. Don't care. Yeah. He does look like him, doesn't he? Yes, he does. Yeah. You are a horse lord slut, and now you've woken the dragon. <laughs> Khaleesi of the Dothraki. I am the wife of the great Carl, and I carry his son inside me. The next time you raise a hand to me will be the last time you have hands. Right? Long time coming. Yeah. That's great. I love the look of just dumb fear on his face. I wouldn't doubt it. What color hair? Red. And her, um, her, uh, you don't want to know. Not that good. Better. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> <He's>... <laughs> he reminds me of someone. Well, who's that? Get out of here. <laughs> but I'm not going to say. All right. The horses died first. Didn't have enough to feed them to keep them warm. Eating the horses was easy. But later when we started to fall, that wasn't easy. We should have had a couple of boys like you along, shouldn't we? Cheery sort of fellow. He's a hard man. <laughs> He's seen some shit. Yeah. <laughs> We've been sitting here for days! Start the damn joust before I piss myself. <laughs> What's that? Sir Gregor Clegane. They call him the Mountain. Jeez. Jeez. Oh, that's cool. This is, this is gonna be enjoyable. I can tell already. No, I mean, like a five-gallon bucket over his head. Yeah, I know. <laughs> We met Grandmaster Pycel a little bit more. The guy with the beard, right? Uh, I always, this always blew my mind whenever I realized this. He is General Veers from Star Wars, the the general that is in charge of the AT-AT attacking the rebel base in Episode Five. Ah, Remember, he has the helmet yes. and the chest piece. Yes, uh, that's him. I ah, was like, oh, he's from Gen Doctor Who as well. Yeah, he's in Doctor Who as well. I just I remember like seeing him like General Veers, prepare your men, you know? Yeah. Yeah. So I always like, oh yeah, it's General Veers, that's so cool. That's he, awesome. Yeah. I always love whenever you, you know, you don't know an actor super well and then you realize he's in all these things you love. You yeah. Know? It's really cool when you see that kind of stuff. It's interesting the character of Ned Stark. He walks out on, walks about on foot like a common man almost. Alone. Yeah, alone. Yeah. Fact is it. Is that how you speak to your king? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's funny, is it? He, he shouldn't have laughed. He should not have laughed. No. You don't like the hand's joke? <laughs> it's in the poor boy. You heard the hand. The king's too fat for his armour. Go find the breastplate stretcher. Now! Breastplate stretcher. <laughs> The breastplate stretcher. Is he riding a, an in-heat mare? Boris knew his mare was in heat. Quite crafty, really. Yep. You got it, Calvin. Mm. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. Ugh. Gotta keep hitting them. Until you're sure. Yep. Double tap. First, you need a woman. 
Nothing like a woman after a fight. Well, I'm willing if she is. <laughs> uh, I liked him. Game is good. But he's never seen Ned fight either. He hasn't. He's fought two wars. Kill him. Oh. Mm. Is that all? He's one of his men. My favorite words for a house is either Theon's, uh, the Greyjoys. Theirs is called, we do not sow. Meaning that they're not farmers, they don't do agriculture, they take everything. Oh, wow. We do not sow, we reap. <laughs> and what they call it, uh, what do they call it? They say the iron price. Like, you can buy things, that's the gold price, but the iron price is we take it. Wow. You know? I, cool. I really like I... the Greyjoys like that. And then the Baratheon, theirs is ours is the fury. I've always loved that one. Every time I see like a uh, like a yellow, because their colors are yellow and black, and it's a stag. So every time I see like a deer crossing sign, I always want to put like ours is the fury on. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be great. Yeah, I'd love that. Yeah. I'd love to see that. Yeah, we need to start doing that. It's pretty rare where you get a sweet summer child like Calvin that has not seen Game of Thrones. Now I know what that term means. You do, <laughs> and you will learn more tonight because we are watching episode six, A Golden Crown. Now I know what that means. Let's find out. I don't know what that means. You're going to. <laughs> I should wear the armor and you the gown. She'll wear this like a badge of honor. Where is it silence? Or I'll honor you again. Wow. I love it. Oh, that that's, line. That's such a cutting line. I'll honor you again. <laughs> wow. I mean, I don't condone beating women. We'll talk when I return from the hunt. The hunt? Killing things clears my head. <laughs> she... She's gonna try it in there. She's gonna try what? She's putting it in the embers. You don't think that these things which have been around for hundreds of years, have they haven't tried to do that. They're rocks, Calvin. They're rocks. They're fossilized. So? That's what they think. They're rocks. They're fossilized. Yeah, Nobody but, knows. So, no one, no one legend. Just, no one just threw that in a fire just to see. Maybe like very careful heating up to uh, temperature. Mm -hmm. Like as a careful mother would. Uh. But you need to get a dragon egg rock incubator. Yeah, apparently. It just okay. raises the temperature All gradually. Right. By many months. Oh. You're hurt. <laughs> You're hurt? <laughs> what the heck happened there? And there is only one thing we say to death. Not today. Like you like that? Yeah. I like it. Like the one your mother wears. You'll be queen someday. It's only fitting you should look the part. I told you, he just misunderstood, Calvin. You judge him so bad. Oh no, he's dressing his bride up to be to look like his mother. And I meant to be his queen and have his babies. Seven hell. Well, you're old enough. <laughs> He'll be the greatest king that ever was, a golden lion, and I'll give him sons with beautiful blonde hair. The lion's not his sigil, idiot. He's a stag like his father. He is not. He's nothing like that old drunk king. I think Where's, he's figuring it out. Where's that big giant book? Ah, uh, looks like a whole bunch of family trees and stuff like that. Lord Oris Baratheon, black of hair. Axel Baratheon, black of hair. Lionel Baratheon, black of hair. Stefan Baratheon, black of hair. It's a dominant trait. Robert Baratheon, black of hair. Joffrey Baratheon, golden haired.
the seed is strong. Hmm. You figure it out episodes ago, Calvin. I'm happy I did. Yeah. Look away, he's get his golden crown. He was no dragon. Fire cannot kill a dragon. Hmm. See? What? I told you there was something going on. With what? With the egg! <laughs> you gotta... I would not want to be that guy right now. <laughs> Yes. He's hype. He is hype. <laughs> Get hype. <laughs> right? It's that look. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> did warn you not to trust me. He did. That's your boy. That's your favorite character, yeah. right? I didn't say he was my favorite. <laughs> oh, okay, now, now he's not your favorite. Fuck! <laughs> so now it's definitely Tyrion. <laughs> Probably. Yeah, so... Man, what's he doing? <laughs> You will be speaking to me with more respect. Kill the Bravosi. Bring the girl. He took that man down with full armor and a sharp sword with a wooden stick. What do we say to the god of death? Not today. Not today. Go. They've all sworn to defend my father, have they not? They have. Now we see what the words are worth. I like that that smile yeah. that he had on his face when he walked away. Yeah. He's very proud and like, yeah. Like, this is not a boy anymore. Yeah. It must be. Good. Why is that good? It means you're not stupid. I do like him. Yeah. Theon? Yeah. I never remember the name, but yeah. I really like Tyrion. <laughs> yeah. He's one of those bad guys that are so smooth, you hate to hate them. Do you consider him a bad guy? Not really, that's the problem. Welcome to Game, I mean, of, welcome to Game of Thrones, He's a Calvin. Lannister. Welcome to Game of Thrones. And I should hate him, but I do not. Kind of uh, left with a whimper, I thought. But uh, still a lot happened this episode. I'm just displeased. Yeah? <laughs> welcome to Game of Thrones. I want everything... To be nice and good. No. No. <laughs> I'm not stupid. <laughs> yeah, okay. But I would like it to go slightly different. Yeah. What do you want? <laughs> Filch? It's pleasure to see you again after so many years. Yep. Oh, <laughs> That's perfect. Your boy's too proud. Five. Out. All in here. He's a lot shorter. <laughs> <laughs> Fifty inches, a little flower, and the honey's all mine. This song always gives me chills. It's like the Stark song. Yeah. Oh! 
in New York. What is to be done with this traitor, Your Grace? Bring me his head. Do you know why people don't like episode nines? Oh, Calvin, welcome to Game of Thrones. Say that every episode. <laughs> I know. Because it, it's kind of morbid, really. We all cried and hated what we had seen, and now, now we just want to watch others yeah. feel the same way. <laughs> so, like, uh, yeah. Like gathering everyone yeah, like to your... <laughs> it, like feel, it makes you feel better if you, someone else get sad about yeah. it so uh aaron is joining us on our season finale and season premiere of season two game huh? of thrones am i yeah yes wow you are now but as always the focus is on our <coughs> sweet summer child calvin who has not read the books not seen the show so this is the first time he will be seeing episode 10 fire and blood <laughs> Bells doth wrap their horses and tents, and there's the history of Westeros for Game of Thrones. It's kind of like this. That's what we do. Let's watch it. This is going to be my face until Eddard Stark lives again. Don't make me laugh. Crack! Calvin, <laughs> <laughs> didn't you say you liked Joffrey at some point? <laughs> Let's so you go. do watch our reactions. <laughs> there we go. Get up, all of you. Not you. <laughs> Good job, Calvin. <laughs> Only gonna happen. Holy shit, look at his eyes. Yeah. Does that well. And they had that whole sun and stars, moon of my life thing. Such a cute couple. And. What else is she gonna do? I mean, she could have just held his nostrils closed with her hand. <laughs> you alright? I want what you earn. Is that what you fear? Said your abundance. What do we do with witches? <laughs> Burn the witches! <laughs> I 
I knew it! I know, Calvin. I know it! Just watch the show. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's a bit of a game changer. What, tiny little lizards? Uh, hope it gets bigger! I don't know, the, the screaming kind of feels like a velociraptor yeah. in the beginning of uh, Jurassic Park. And thus the season ends with the scream of a dragon that we haven't seen for 300 years. Now, Calvin, you had no idea there would be dragons, right? <laughs> there were dragon eggs. <laughs> <laughs> what, like Where there's fire and dragon eggs, no. there will be dragons. No. <laughs> what did uh, the witch say? Only death can pay for life. Cal Drogo is a king, mm -hmm. and his blood and his death birthed those dragons. I this mean, was a magical you, event. Freaking Joffrey, man. Yeah, I think that's a pretty fair assessment of season one. <laughs> Freaking, Freaking Joffrey. Joffrey man. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, I remember feeling that way. Yeah. I don't remember ever liking him though in the beginning. Yeah. I didn't I never said that I <laughs> liked him. I said that I could see where there was he a is possibility. Nice and good. He's a kind I and just king. Never <laughs> said that. Okay guys, so that's gonna be everything for season one of uh, I almost said Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> of Game of Thrones. I had a lot of fun doing this. It was really fun to just rewatch the show. So, yeah. uh, I encourage you guys, if you haven't already, to go back and watch all of them and check out our reactions. And come back tomorrow, which is Sunday, for the premiere of Season 2. I don't remember what the name is. We'll find out tomorrow. I don't know. I'm sure it's something awesome. Probably. That's going to be everything. I'm Eric. I'm Calvin. I'm Eric. And we'll see you guys tomorrow for Season 2. Calvin. Button. When you play the game of thrones, you win, you die. Who am I? Who am I? Excellent then, Fred. I, I cannot make an investment based on wishes and dreams. You're my prisoner. You're not a free woman. That's what prisoner means. Aren't you always so clever with your schemes and your plots?